<laughs> Sorry, I thought I'd give you guys a little taste of the old Matters game. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is Matters, playing the games that matter, and today, we're going to be taking a look at Skull and Bones. Apparently, from what I've heard, a lot of people are shitting on this game. This game has been years and years in development, uh, it's had tons of rollbacks, but today, I'm going to be playing Skull and Bones, and giving you guys my opinions, and letting you know if it's good, or if it's bad. Now, I don't read up anything about games before they come out. What I like to do is, I like to experience the game for myself, and give my own opinion. I don't take any opinions that other people have had before I have the chance to experience it for myself. So with that being said, let's get into it. So what is Skull and Bones? Skull and Bones was originally the backbone engine of Assassin's Creed 4's sailing. You know, when you used to be able to travel around and get a, get on a ship and all that stuff, when that was brand new, Skull and Bones was basically already being thought of as a project that they can continue on into the future. Because everybody loves the sailing and the ship combat in Assassin's Creed 4. It was just just that good. It was really, really amazing and very innovative for its time. And now after about seven years of development, it's finally come out. Seven years or something similar to that. I don't know for sure, but we're going to check it out. Basically, pirate game. Pirate, pirate. Yar. Coffers with coins tainted in blood. And okay. where there is blood. There is pussy. There are predators. Oh, oops. Uh, sorry about that. This is turning is very floaty. I mean, it's a ship, so I mean, yeah, but... Oh, God, not the British fleet. So much noise happening. I can't... Uh, oh, God. Ram him. Yeah. What the... F Dude, what the hell is... What is happening? What the... F More guys? What am I supposed to be shooting at? I literally have one cannon on this ship. This is a terrible ship. Who gave me this ship? I think we might lose. Dude, it is so actually genuinely hard to aim this. Like, what the hell? Dude, may the woman come to bring us pussy and pee and come. Oh my dear God. We're fucked. We're, we're dead. We're dead and we died. <clears throat> and that was Skull and Bones, everybody. Thank you for watching. Oh, it's still going. Okay, we didn't die. We just got burned very badly. Oh, sorry, he- no, that guy's just black. Oops, sorry about that. I'm not gonna lie, I do like this character selection screen. It does look pretty cool. I like this guy. What is he? He looks like- I don't even know what he looks like, but he's got green eyes like me, so we'll take him. Let's go like a little Post Malone or something. In your eyes. I have seen the same that guy just scratches his armpit before. and you can hear it. I'm sure you <laughs> we must first know the way. We yeah. know the way. Do you know the way? Wow, this guy looks completely different from how he looked earlier. He looked kind of cool, and now, uh... <laughs> Bro, that is a long braid, bro. I didn't even see that. This thing's gigantic. And if you had kept the British off our backs, we would not be in this shit kettle in the first place. Oh, shut up, dude. You're you're a big old doo doo head, is what I think. Cause you smell like doo doo, and you have a head. Find your own way to Saint Anne, chum sniffer. What? <laughs> I don't owe you a sliver up your ass, especially when mine's on the line. I will stab you. Ubisoft Singapore. How many more Ubisoft logos are we gonna get? Ubisoft Belgrade. Ubisoft Berlin. Ubisoft Chengdu. Chen what the fuck is that? Montreal. Mumbai. Paris. Philippines. Poon. Shanghai. Skull and Bones. A Ubisoft original. Guys, who do you think made this game? Rockstar? You got spirits. Wait, what? Did that fucking pirate- Did that ship just literally disappear into the- What happened? And why would others sail with a captain with one leaky boat to their name? Because I'm awesome. Because of my ponytail, maybe? This is a rammer. Rammer? I barely even know her. Now we're in war! It's war time! It's time to kill and die and burn and set people on fire. Yeah! Take that, you Italian, French, whatever you are. I don't even care what you are, but you're dead. I do not discriminate when it comes to killing. Oh. Well, I was supposed to go way down here. Okay. <laughs> Who was I killing? I have no idea. Okay, well, uh, they're dead now, so... Change physical appearance. Here we go. Now I can finally change my ponytail. And people stop making fun of my ponytail. I guess we'll go with this. This looks pretty cool. It's like Jesus. <laughs> Should we go full on like pirate Jesus? That would be kind of funny, actually. Now, you know what's funny? It's like, he looks great. But if you look at the chair behind him, I don't even think they modeled the bumps on the chair. It's like a flat texture. Just a, <laughs> it's like a, just a flat chair. Why bleed for others when you could suck them dry? 
That, uh, I don't like that phrasing. Suck him dry. I hope he's not sucking anybody dry. Okay, so I can't tell if I'm still playing the intro. It's been two hours and I don't know what this game is. Like, I still can't tell because basically nothing has really happened yet. I still think the weirdest thing about this game is when you are on land, the controls are just so weird and the character just doesn't know what he's doing. What is this? What is this running? What is happening? And sometimes you just stop and he'll just start doing this. Why is he walking backwards like that? It's so confusing. No, we don't need a fast travel. We're just going to set sail. Does it have to play this cutscene every time? I stopped at a place for like two seconds and then I had to play a cutscene just to get back in my boat. Okay, well this place is being blown up. I don't know if I should land here. Doesn't seem like a very nice place. Well, I'll just deliver this and get the fuck out of here. Um, premium is $89.99? Hell no. Excuse me? So, what did I think of it so far? Well, I think it's all right. It's not terrible yet. I haven't discovered really the complete ins and outs of this game, but I still have a couple more hours left to play on the, uh, the thing. So I will uh, stop it right there. Have you played this game? Did you play this game and did you enjoy it or did you hate it? Let me know down in the comments down below. Uh, that's going to be it for today, everybody. I hope you liked that first impressions video. My name is Matters, playing the games that matter, and I will see you next time.